where we've all faced this uh, situation from time to time where we've forgotten our password and we can't log on to the system. Now this is a Windows 7 Ultimate operating system and I'm going to show you a way how to bypass the password if you've forgotten it. Now obviously um, if you're a technician you've always need to uh, get past the passwords now not always you remember you don't always remember to ask for the password so this is a good way of actually resetting the password or maybe it's a friend's PC or something of that nature and uh, he said you could use it and you forgot to give you the password for that account okay or whatever reason it is that you want to actually get past it now I did make a video uh, with a program called Comboot on Windows Vista and apparently they say it works with Windows 7 but I've had a lot of messages saying it doesn't work with Windows 7 and uh, and on the forums I've had a lot of people saying it doesn't work with Windows 7 so what we're going to do is show you a, a method uh, uh, to getting past this problem with another program okay so let's restart the system and uh, boot up our CD now I've got my CD in the drawer so what I'm going to do is reboot and boot to that CD Okay, so we want to push the uh, any key there to boot this up. This is going to load up our uh, CD. Now you will see a Windows Vista look to it here, and that's just the CD, so don't worry about that. So this is Windows 7. We're booting, uh, changing the password on. This is just the actual CD you can see. Okay, so this is the actual program. It's a very simple program to use. We're going to be using the SAM method. Okay, now if you highlight over these, it gives you little useful speech bubbles to tell you what's going on. So we're going to actually be using this method here. Okay, now also we're going to be using the reset and change user account password. There is some other stuff here, but we're going to be using that. So go next. And also I want to leave these as they are and go next again here. Oh, my mouse has gone a bit mad. Okay, go next. Now you can see the accounts here and um, basically what we want to do is we want to click on the test account because that's the account that um, we've been using. So as you can see it's an administrator account and it's also locked so that's because there's a password on it so go next. All we need to do is highlight it and then go next okay like this I'll show you just highlight it and go next and then uh, all we need to do here is put your new password in basically and uh, that's it or you can leave it blank to reset it okay so if you want to leave it blank because there was a password on there we'll leave it blank and it says the account has been successfully modified okay click OK so there's going to be no password on there now click exit we're going to restart the system say yes and then we just got to restart the system take the CD out of the drawer and restart Okay, so Windows is now starting up. And hopefully we should uh, be getting to Windows. Okay, so there you see. We've, all we've done is reset the password, took the password off and uh, you could actually put change the password if you wanted to or you could just do what I did there and reset it and took the password completely out of the equation okay so I hope this has been some use for you my name is my my name is Brian from brightech.co.uk if you enjoy these videos remember please hit the subscribe button on my channel also if you want to head over to my forum yeah you've got your forum here brightechcomputers.co.uk forward slash forum okay and uh, you can actually register there for free and uh, add to the community and uh, try and ask and answer people's questions and help out or maybe you've got a problem with your own computer and you want to post it up on this forum here by all means do so okay rather than posting it on the uh, YouTube channel so thanks again for watching guys thanks for your support bye for now